Now we're going to begin with Duchess Megan's father. He's breaking his silence, speaking out in a wide range of interview this morning. He's talking about everything from the royal wedding and Prince Harry to politics. ABC's Adrian Banker is here with more. Good morning, Adrian. Good morning to you too, Michael. Yes, Pierce Morgan admits Good Morning Britain paid Thomas Markle, quote, a few thousand pounds to do this interview with Good Morning Britain. And he speaks out about how it felt to not walk his daughter down the aisle and his very open conversations with Prince Harry. Fatherly love. Overnight, Meghan Markle's dad reveals the royal couple could be ready for a baby. She's wanted children for a long time. When she met Harry and she spoke about how much she loves him, there's got to be a child in the making somewhere soon. In an exclusive interview with Good Morning Britain, Thomas Markle speaks out for the first time since the royal wedding, opening up about how the intercontinental romance unfolded from his perspective. The first phone calls were. Daddy, I have a new boyfriend. And then the next call was like, he's British. And then eventually the third time around was like, he's a prince. He says he was hardly phased by his son-in-law's royal status. He says they even discussed politics. I was complaining I didn't like Donald Trump. He said, give Donald Trump a chance. I sort of disagreed with that. When it came time for Prince Harry to ask for Meghan's hand, he was protective. And I said, you're a gentleman. Promise me you'll never raise your hand against my daughter, and of course I give you my permission. Thomas says he missed his daughter's wedding to have emergency heart surgery and admits that cooperating with the paparazzi in this series of photos was a serious mistake, adding, it's hard to take back. He also confessed to being jealous of Prince Charles walking his daughter down the aisle, but says about the future king, I wish it was me, but thank God he was there, and I thank him for that. Adding that even if he couldn't be there, he knew his daughter was right where she belongs. My daughter's been a princess since the day she was born. And Thomas also relates his admiration for the queen, saying, I think she's one of the most incredible women in the world, and I would love to meet her. No comment yet from the palace, though he might just get his wish. He's just possible. throwing that out yeah. there. Yeah, it's a little subtle hint. Right, exactly. <laughs> well, well, David and I and you, we know how it's... Well, all four of us were all there. Right? Yeah. Yeah. All four of us were there. It was a party. Yeah. I course. have some pictures. You know, I <laughs> <laughs> yes. yes, I do remember that. You didn't that. miss a thing. Yeah, but thank you, Agent. Thanks yes. so much. Absolutely. <laughs> Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.